Welcome back to The Price of Business. I'm your host, Kevin Price, talking to you about you and your business. Interesting company out there called DT Search. And Elizabeth Thieves, she's director of sales at that company. And delighted to have her on the program today. Elizabeth, how are you? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm doing great myself. So we've got so much in common just to start off with. And uh, tell me a little bit, uh, you wrote an article over there at priceofbusiness.com. Uh, actually, David Deed uh, over there um, on DT Search. Tell us a little bit about the company. And I want to encourage the listener to check out uh, dtsearch.com, both at the website, which is exactly uh, as it sounds. It's uh, literally uh, DT Search. DogThomasSearch.com, and also you can check it out at PriceOfBusiness.com. Kind of give us your elevator speech to get us started. Sure. Uh, just an overview of the company. Sure. Yeah. We were founded in 1991, and what we offer currently is enterprise and developer text retrieval software, along with document filters. What that means is we offer the ability to do searching and the ability to support a whole range of file and other data types. Interesting. What is the, um, you know, and I imagine 1991, I mean, you, you guys got started really, in, you know, after years of, of people being uh, much more connected to a computer, or actually being connected to a computer, computer, but really before the Internet was, was anything of significance. So how has the Internet changed your business over the years? Well, we started out back in 1991 as DT Search for DOS. <laughs> <laughs> For those who aren't familiar with DOS, go to the Smithsonian <laughs> Institution. But anyway, go ahead. And then we moved to Windows. Yes. <laughs> You're very nimble, aren't you? <laughs> and then we moved to the web online with DT Search Web while still maintaining the Windows product line. Okay, very good. And so you, you're, you're accommodating uh, various needs with the overwhelming one, of course, being uh, the web uh, web base and growth. Kind of give me, for the, for the person who isn't really familiar or may not even ask for your kind of services, bring it down to that level. Explain exactly what you do, you know, and, and what kind of companies use your services. We basically search terabytes of data. So if you have... A smaller quantity of data, you don't need us. Just use Windows Search. If you have terabytes of data and you need to instantly search them and retrieve them with highlighted hits, then call us. And it's basically terabytes of any type of text-based data. So it can be emails, including the full text of attachments. It can be office documents. It can be PDFs. It can be web-based content, like... SharePoint content or www.ourcompetitor.com or whatever. Yeah. So um, that's interesting. And talk a little bit about um, the type of businesses that typically use your service. There are two types of customers that we have. It, it tends to be large companies in both cases, but there are two types of, of customers that we have. One is basically looking to use us to search their own text, their own data. The second is basically building an application or a website and wants to embed search in that for other people to do searching. Okay. And of those larger companies, let me ask you a different question. What is your uh, competitors like? Are, do you have a lot of competitors in this domain space? We have some. Anything <laughs> that makes money, been... I guess. Anything that makes money is going to have competitors. That's correct. Yeah. I mean, for example... There's HP Autonomy, and in the document filters or the data support realm, there's Oracle. Mm -hmm. So, but yeah, very interesting. So that's interesting. Is there certain parts of the country that you're you're more uh, prominent in, or are you actually an international firm? Talk a little bit about that. We do sell internationally. We support data of any language, so it can be anything from. Arabic to Chinese to English to German to Russian to Swahili. We don't care. Wow, that's fantastic. Yeah. And uh, with uh, you know, w with that, in terms of, of when people come to you looking for your services, what is usually the motivating factor? What has taken place where they contact you? They realize that they're developing an application and need to add text searching because everybody expects it. Or they're 
panicking in their company because they are having trouble finding the memo that relates to ABC. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and so there's something that has happened that uh, and they've tried all other conventional means uh, and it simply hasn't worked and they need to bring out the big guns. Or they, or they realize that they're losing productivity by not instantly searching terabytes of text by yeah. doing some slower method of searching. That's true, because let's face it, time really is money, isn't it? It really is, and it's also finding the right stuff. And one of the things about DT Search is we dig really deep. So we'll search not only an email, for example, but if you have an email with a zip file and a PDF and a Word document in that, and the Word document embeds an access database, we'll search the whole shebang. Wow, that's amazing. Well, I appreciate you so much being with us today. Thank you very much. Elizabeth Thee, she is Director of Sales at DT Search. That's DTSearch.com, DTSearch.com. When we come back, much more for you, and you're listening to The Price of Business. 